the prices of things are not going to go down ever, no matter who you vote for at this point. Inflation right now is at like a 3%, which is exactly where the Fed wants it to be. And that's good. Okay. The only way you're going to see prices of goods go down is if we have a deflation. And if that happens, that means the economy is doing terribly and we're in dire troubles. The economy is doing well. Inflation is low. The prices of things are high because of corporate greed. Because inflation's at like a 3%, Fed should be dropping the interest rates come September. That's definitely a good thing for sure, especially if you're looking to buy a house. But the only way you're going to see more money in your pocket is higher wages. That's it. Because the prices of things, the prices of goods, the prices of food, they're never going down again. What we have is what we have. We just might have a slightly less increase now that inflation is at a 3%. Corporations are basically like, oh, you use this product on a regular basis. You need this product, right? So we're going to charge you double now because we can. Like, what are you going to do? You're going to make this product at home yourself. You're going to start a farm. You're going to grow your own food. You're going to slaughter your own animals. You're not going to do that. We can charge whatever the heck we want. And they did. And they're getting away with it because nobody can stop them. No president can stop them. Because again, this is a worldwide issue. This is not just US based. This is corporate greed globally, everywhere. And it's terrible.